We're at Durhamtown Off-Road Park in Union Hill, Georgia. Yep. This place may look familiar to some of you because if you watch earlier seasons of Faster with Finnegan, we brought the vet cart here where Finnegan jumped it when he was rally racing it and completely destroyed the front end and busted the oil pan in that car. Dude, he tacoed it. Yep. Since that episode, Dave and I have always wanted to go rally racing. Oh, yeah. So guess what? We're back here to do that. That's right. Today is the day where we're going to get to get behind the wheel and go around this track that's 1.6 miles long, has 14 turns. That's crazy. It's going to have some serious speed, and there's a lot of jumps. Jumpy so, jumps and slidey yeah. slides. Yeah, this car is low. It rides like pure crap <laughs> on this particular surface. I just hope we chose the right car. We did choose the right car. In the rally world, a lot of the guys use imports. There's simply not a good muscle car that's all-wheel drive. Mm -mm. I figure this is the next best thing. So. <laughs> Look, we are muscle car guys. We like V8s. We like the horsepower. But I'll tell you what, this car we picked out is going to be pretty good. Well, get some, dog. Get and believe it or not, this car right here isn't an import. It was actually made in normal Illinois in the good old US of A by Diamond Star Motors for Chrysler's Eagle division. So in a strange way, this sport compact has a chromosome or two of American muscle in its DNA. It's basically the American version of Mitsubishi's very popular Eclipse. Yep, you're looking at a 1991 Eagle Talon TSI. It is not our normal build. It is not a muscle car, but I'm gonna tell you, you tell me where you could find a muscle car that's all-wheel drive in our price range. These cars came factory with 190 horsepower and 200 foot-pounds of torque. They made a two-wheel drive version TSI and an all-wheel drive version. We have an all-wheel drive version. Let me know what's going on with this thing, Dave. So you haven't really seen this car no. yet, so let me tell you all about it. This thing is not stock in Dude. any way. Dude. In any way. Dude. Supposedly, this thing makes 400 horsepower it's got aftermarket pistons, it's board 20 over, aftermarket camshafts, <sighs> aftermarket turbo, air-to-air -air intercooler. I mean, fuel system, you name it, it's got it. But when I test drove it, it set me back in the seat. Once I figured out it was all-wheel drive, I was hooked. These cars came with a really small turbo. This one is big. This thing should be dialed in. It's got knobs everywhere. I just want to start twisting some stuff. But I, it, runs, it runs too good right now, Don't so I'm going to just leave it alone. Cool. So our goal is going to be simple. We're going to take this Eagle Talon, and we're going to go rally racing with it. Not only are we going to go rally racing with it, we're going to make this an effective rally car. But first, we need to bring out our competitor, whose car kind of runs good, but sometimes don't run good. Shay brought a 2000 Subaru WRX with a 5.3 LS engine that makes about 350 horsepower, backed by a T56 Magnum six-speed with a Nissan 350Z rear axle setup versus our 1991 Eagle Talon TSI all-wheel drive. It's slammed, big turbo, a bunch of power. We ready to party. So Shay and I are getting ready to make the first run in his car. He feels very optimistically positive that he's gonna kill this track. I don't know. Now, as you know, I don't really ride with anybody, Shay. So A, I have two rules. Let's hear him. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Here we go. Are you guys ready? Ten, four, three, two, one, go. Thing's pretty spicy. Yeah, you're driving pretty good, buddy. Oh, wow. <laughs> this thing runs really good. Good turn, good turn. You can drive, brother. Okay, this is a jump. You thank you for the brickies. Oh, boy. <laughs> now, if this was an import version, all-wheel drive, I can see why the center of it is, that why it's actually working pretty good. Oh, good trip, buddy. Good, good, good. He's wheeling great. Oh, 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 there's a bump over here. I'm assuming he's giving Cotton a hell of a ride in that car. This center's really good. It's balanced really nice as it goes over bumps. <laughs> Is that fun? <laughs> you about killed us. Oh, that was a little too much, boys. This is awesome. I don't know if our talent's gonna do this. Oh, yeah. Come on, Shay. <laughs> Come on, Shay. <laughs> you can feel your nitrous coming on, too, bro. Man, this is great. Oh, yeah. Here we good go. Turn, good turn, good turn, good turn. Oh, yeah. Oh, good turn. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, <laughs> Yo! Ah, oh my God! Ah, where you going? We gotta stop! We gotta 
<laughs> All right, Jay, look. You guys built a killer car, dude. I'm telling you. What is this, this dude? dude? Wow. I think I found my new favorite kind of driving. So you like this, huh? Oh, it's fantastic. How did that lap feel? Uh, it felt amazing. OK. I don't know or care if it was fast. Dude, that was fun. Because that was. That was fun. Easily the most fun I've ever had in my entire life. So you went a 152.33. This is fun. This is. I'm antsy to get behind the wheel. So dude. you're already suited up. Yep, yep. Let me go get suited up. Yep, yep. Let's make a rip, dude. Because <laughs> that looked great. like so much fun. Oh, it was a blast, dude. I can't wait to see what the T Allen does. Let's go. Good luck, boys. Have fun. Yeah, yeah. So time to beat minute 52.3, which pretty good. I think a. I think a 145-ish is probably doable if I had better suspension, but this is a good time. I don't think they're going to beat it. They don't have any suspension. Give me the thumbs up if you're ready. All right, three, two, one, go. Okay, you found out. All right. Oh, yeah, you. Oh, David Newberg, you killed. What? What has got the power? What has got the power? There. David's getting there already? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, this has got a turbo on it that's really big, so the boost comes on pretty hard. And it rides pretty decent. The turbo is making some boost. Holy cow, it's making some boost. Sounds like he's on the limiter. Now, that thing doesn't have a sequential. It's just got a regular H pattern shifter. So he's going to be working it pretty hard. Dave, this is air up here. <laughs> this is air. <laughs> OK, look, guys. Compared to both cars, the WRX is a little bit, oh, ow, 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 is a little bit flatter. As I would oh, say. Oh, God! Our car is. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Oh, God! This is great! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> okay. This is. <laughs> oh, man, this is awesome. He's definitely approaching the back. It's going to be close. Okay, this is a jump. <laughs> Whoa, hail! <laughs> what in the hail? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Oh, God. What in the hail did you just do? Oh. Huh. I don't know about you no more, Newburn. I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure these tires are I junk. I just scared the crap out of cotton. I like this little talon. Holy cow. You guys should be proud. Riding in both. Oh, no. Riding in both the vehicles, one being real wheel drive, one being all wheel drive, you can tell the difference when we're coming off of a jump or in a corner. As into the rear wheel drive, we'll kick out and go a little blip, blip, blip. The all wheel drive definitely pulls way harder. The all wheel drive just goes straight. This man, I don't know what he was doing, but we was jumping and he was giggling, but he wasn't breathing. And then we went sideways and almost into the tree land. And I don't know what this is. I got your time. What do you guys think it was, first of all? How fast You went a minute 52. I'm going to say 205. 210. That's sliding for 50 feet. That was the only thing that prevented you guys from being in the bush, was the slide from 50 feet. I know. Thank you guys you, should be proud. You did two minutes flat. And we, we died in the, I know. Was in the ditch. We had to restart over there. Just think if we, oh, man. The talent is where it's at. I like this car. It probably doesn't like me. Uh, sorry. All right, we got eight seconds to make up. We need to lift this. Let's go build. Let's go. I got to find some bead lugs. Good luck, boys. Yeah. <laughs> what up, Shabo? 
What'd you guys do to it? What do you mean, what do we do to it? I mean, driver mod was the main thing, but uh, we have a brand new set of wheels and tires. We have some winter tread going on that should do pretty well over the street tires that were on here before. Maybe a little bit. After market coilovers, we've raised it an inch above stock. Because it was inch and three quarter lowered all the way around with a sport line setup, you know. Did you guys do any weight reduction? What are you looking at me for? No, I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> what about the cage? I see a cage in there. Yeah, we actually added weight. I don't know if you noticed, but Cotton got really quiet when we finished that last run, and that never happens. I think he was a little scared. So we, oh, did, we did add a little roll bar in there with some good harnesses, so we feel a little safer. And then we added a skid plate because, you know. <laughs> you get suited up, you watch. Whatever you do, don't break it, because I want to drive it. Yeah, if it actually survives, <laughs> I'll, we'll toss you the keys. We are strapped in. We're about to make our first run. Let's see if we can close that eight second gap. If I can do a clean A to B, we'll definitely knock off some time. I am ready. All right, if you guys can hear me, I'm gonna do the countdown. Three, two, one, go. There we go. Oh yeah. Well, this is a lot better already. Oh, that was good. First jump that we went, second jump's good. We have more droop on the suspension. So now we got a nice cushion as we're coming down. Instead of like pogo in. Get it, New Bird. Little bit of mud, hit it. Oh, baby. It just, it's working perfect. Tires are doing little grippy grips. Come on, baby. Get on there, New Bird. Um, get on that gasoline pedal. So there's a handful of jumps that are really kind of aggressive through here. Even with that kind of suspension, I'd still be a little worried. <laughs> awesome! Awesome! We'll go, oh, don't hit that tire! Oh, don't hit the tire! We got this! Let's go! Let's go! Whoa! This is a rally car! It is driving great! It's handling the suspension, it's doing everything! Tires are going good! All right, Dave! You didn't wipe out! Let's go! Let's go! There's the other gear. Oh my gosh. Here they come. Get it, get it, go! Woohoo! Woohoo! Oh, we lifted a little bit. Woohoo! Oh, yes! Oh! That was a good time, man. It's been the first time that we drove this to this. This is a really rally car now, man. Oh, like, oh. it works amazing. So you could feel the difference. The tires were on the ground more. It was a nice landing on everything we did. That was, dude, dude. That was amazing. That was awesome. That was awesome. Amazing. That was awesome. First run, which is probably not gonna be the fastest, 152.8, which I believe is right at my fastest time. T. I Allen. I want to do it again. I, want, I can go faster. I want to do it again. Okay, I agree. So that car has huge improvements, and I think there's still plenty left in it. Not bad, boys, not bad. So the boys have the first run in the books, and it was actually a really good one, especially for the first one. It probably beat my fastest time from the last time we were here. I decided not to tell him, because oftentimes I can get in your head. He says there's plenty of speed left in the car. You should just try to capture that. So we'll see what they can do. Thumbs up, boys, if you're ready. All right, on three, here we go. Let's go, buddy. Three, two, one, go. All right, Newberg's gonna drive it harder. He knows the track. Let's go, buddy. There we go. There we go. Get it, buddy. Go. Yay. <laughs> this thing's awesome! This is awesome! Ruger! Drive it to that edge! Don't go over it, buddy! Whoa! <laughs> 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 ah, that was awesome! One of my favorite parts this whole course. Come out of that left-hander, get on throttle. It's like this sweeping, beautiful left-hand turn. You just stay on the throttle. Fun. You know, there's a jump. <laughs> yeah, yeah, buddy. Woo! Woo! Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, that sucked. Go 
in there. Oh, that one sucked. Woo! <laughs> they bottomed that thing out completely. Oh, my God! Oh. We got air! Dude. We got a lot of air. Listen. The damn wind's too we got, just kept. Oh. We got air. Oh, my God. Listen to me. The harder you drove it, the smoother it was. But I'm old, and this is going to hurt in the morning. Golly, dude. We got some freaking air. Dude, that last jump, we had to go 20 foot. My head dude, would we had, bounce like, off we the headliner. So, and that could be like, maybe we need a suspension seat, right, or something. Oh, but oh. literally, every jump, because the suspension's drooping and it's working, it's amazing. So your first run, any idea what it was? Ballpark. Uh, 156. Oh, I say 155. Was... So on your very first run, you guys did a 152, which tied my fastest run. So we made up eight seconds on the first one with him. Oh, my God. Yeah, simple. Exactly, exactly. Dude, this thing works. Now, how fast do you think the second one Oh, it had been 148, 149. I'm going to say 150. You guys did a 148.9. Yeah. Oh, you guys, oh! I could just, he was hitting it so hard. We were flying around the other ones, and he was hitting them, hitting them. And on that one, he was like, did, did, did. I heard it. I was like, let's Dude. go. And when we launched it, I felt like Ferris Bueller's Day Off when they were jumping. <laughs> I was like, oh, my God. But, you know, now I know why them Duke boys like to jump, because that was fun.